Hey, how's it going? Today I'm going to go over how to draw a cool pumpkin with glasses. It's going to be pretty much cute, I think. Uh, we're going to be going over this. It's going to be step by step for beginners. So if you're a beginner, this should be very easy for you. Um, I'm going to be using this marker right here, a Faber-Castell P.I.T.T. Artist Pen, big brush. You can use any marker you want though, so don't worry about it. Um, also for paper, I'm using computer paper, just straight up the paper that comes around the computer. Uh, so you should be able to have a lot of that. It's really cheap. All right, let's get going. Ah. I'm going to kind of throw the left curve of the pumpkin. And I'm going to go over here, curl it up here. I'm going to find the stem and pull it up. I want kind of a high stem on this one. Pull down. Curl this at the bottom of the stem. I'm just kind of curving the line up a bit. And what I want to do is I want to draw thin lines up. here, down, finding the bottom part of the pumpkin and I'm going to go boom, 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 boom. doesn't matter how many bumps you have at the bottom, but you just kind of want to show it has some rivets of some kind, uh, so, you know, because the pumpkins are not, you know, completely smooth. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go... circle and another before I open up circle it's basically like, like the letter C and the letter C again on one side for one eye then I'm gonna go over here and do the backwards of that backwards C backwards Gonna put like a roundish triangle toward the middle before toward the middle. Uh, before I continue, if you do like lessons like this, please do me a huge favor and subscribe to the channel. When you subscribe, it gives a lot of like energy to the channel. Uh, as far as the algorithm goes, it gives us a lot of uh, you know cool new traffic. Uh, otherwise, it's just good for you as well because I update this channel hardcore, this Halloween channel, really hardcore around August, September, and uh, August, September, October uh, every year. And it'll notification it'll notify you when I put up videos, not just this year, but next year and the year after that. It'll notify you when I start again in case it slips your mind. Uh, so it's really perfect. It's totally free, and there's very a lot of value to the channel. So if you do like this stuff, uh, if you enjoy what you're watching, absolutely uh, click that like if you can. I like click that uh, subscribe like also if you can. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's go back over here, and I'm going to draw a triangle. For the nose. I'm gonna draw this wave shape for the top of the mouth here. I'm gonna go down. Wave shape in the bottom as well. What that's gonna do is gonna make it look kinda like it's, I don't know, happy or ha, ah, like something's going on. And next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually fill these in. Filling them in carefully here. All right, and now let's put the glasses on. That's kind of what we've been waiting for, the glasses themselves. So what I want to do is I'm going to draw around the shapes I already have because the glasses are going to be dark. I'm going to pull probably from outside over here a U shape. It's going to go, it's going to curve underneath, go in between those and, and kind of end up where it's going to be um, right above the nose. Same thing in reverse. And I'm going to connect it here at the glasses. Pull 
down. Here for the glasses. So we got the glasses right. Now we want to make them a little bit thicker because I want them to look a little bit more like glassy by. So I'm going to make it thicker around this side. I'm not going to make it so much thicker around the middle. I might not. And I'm going to fill that in right here. Also over here, make that a little bit thicker on the outside. I'm going to make the center a little bit thicker as well. So next thing I'm gonna do, and that's pretty good. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, so now it, kinda, it could look like an apple right now. So you wanna do is you wanna put these striations in the pumpkin. And I'm gonna do them like this. I'm gonna throw like a dot, a line, line, line. Line, 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 line. Line, line, line. And I'm doing that right here because I don't want it to distract from the actual, um, you know, drawing of the face, what's going on. And so that's why I'm kind of drawing illustrations like so. And I put them like connected dots. You could also do this, draw like these little dots all the way up. It's kind of up to you and how you do it. I'm even gonna put them in the back here, kind of going. Uh, last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of put a little bit of a thicker border over here, a thicker line around the contour. I'm actually doing pumpkin carving this year. I do pumpkin carving every year. Uh, if you do it as well, let me know. Say hi, maybe post a picture somewhere. Well, I don't know. Uh, I'm going to be posting a picture of the pumpkin I'm carving. I'm probably just going to find one on the internet and then copy it, to be honest. I don't feel like doing anything super original as far as... Uh, my actual pumpkin goes. I'm actually going to throw out some thicker lines even right here where it starts the striation but not actually the striation itself. So that's it. Thank you so much. Uh, don't forget there's a lot of cool links in the, in the description. There's a lot of cool playlists of a bunch of cool stuff so go check that out in the description. If you made it this far, please say hi. I will say hi back. Uh, I'll talk to you later.